Hey, what's up, guys? What's up, guys? Coach Bobby here. Co Coach Bobby here. Happy Monday. Happy Monday, guys. So I literally stopped my workout, guys. I'm sitting there working out, getting my Monday workout in, starting the week off right, trying to get right to it, guys. Hopefully, you're doing the same thing, right, in your life, in your dreams, in your fitness, in your career, whatever it is you want to go get after, guys. Every Monday, get after it, chasing it. Right, get out there, get after it, running. Wake up on Monday, ready to grind and get after it, right? So I'm in the middle of my workout, right? Did a WTF workout, work to failure, back, I'm sorry, biceps and chest, right? Now I'm doing a little bit of leg work, a little bit of glute work. Keep my glutes strong, keep my back strong and my hips strong. Right now, I literally stopped my workout to give you a message. All right, to give you a message, I'm listening to my boy Stephen Furtick. He's a pastor out in North Carolina, and he reminded me of this message that, that I had forgotten about. All right, so I'm going through pain right now when I'm working out. When I train, I, I experience the same pain that you guys experience. I promise you. I go through the same nausea. I go through the same pains. I have the same uh, 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 voice in my head that tells me to stay in bed on a Monday morning, right? Or to, or, or, or to go light and not, and not go as hard on a Monday. Uh, that same voice, you guys fight, I fight it, guys. But the difference is, guys, my pain has a purpose, Right, my pain comes with is accompanied by the purpose. So I've been at this long enough, long enough to know that if I go through enough pain, that at the back end of that is what I want, right? Namely, health and a physique I'm proud of, right? And the confidence to walk around and 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 do the things I want to do with my kids and walk around feeling comfortable in what I'm doing and what I'm wearing. So, so my pain is the same as yours, Nancy. The difference is I know what the purpose is. I know why I'm doing it, right? So I'm willing to, to put forth the effort, right? To do one more burpee, right? To do one more push-up, to go a little heavier on the, on, on the rack, to do more legs and to feel nauseous and, 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 and want to throw up. I'm willing to do that because I know, I know on the back end, of that is muscle on the back end of that is conditioning on the back end of that is pride in the way I look and the way I feel so I'm willing to go through the pain because I know it has a purpose right so the problem we have in life is oftentimes when we're going through something right we don't attach the purpose to it right so whatever you're going through whether it's trying to get in shape trying to eat better trying to build a bond with your with your family your you know your friends or whatever trying to build a career or trying to get a degree that pain of studying that pain of going through one more burpee one more box jump one more push up has a purpose with it right so when you're going through you have to make sure that you begin to attach that purpose to every time you want to throw up every time you want to quit attach that purpose to it right that makes it easier Right, makes it doable. It makes you go to your, say to yourself, you know what? I know it hurts. I know it hurts. I know it's frustrating. But at the back end of this, guys, I know I'm gonna get that degree. I'm gonna get a little leaner. I'm gonna feel better wearing that dress. I'm gonna feel better with my son or my daughter playing sports. And so, attaching that purpose to the pain you're going through is the key. And now, here's the real key, guys. Right? Here's the key. I'm always trying to bring that the lessons from the gym to your life. Right, from the boardroom to the living room, from the locker room to the boardroom to the living room, right? From 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 fitness to career to family, right? The lessons are 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 across everything we do, right? So here's the deal, guys. It's the same thing in our lives, right? When you're going through struggles and trials and tribulations, right? God is putting you through that for a reason. Right? I've gone through some pain and some struggle in the fi past five years for a reason to get ready for moments like this, to get ready to be a mentor to my children, to be a communicator and inspirer and motivator to people of the masses, right? I went through that struggle for that purpose. So now I'm better at knowing what I'm going through. I'm better at understanding it's for a purpose. So now when I go through stuff, right, car breaking down, this this bill is due, uh, uh, this, you know, my son or daughter did this wrong, I did this wrong, I had a conflict in my class, I know all of it is for a reason, all of it is a learning lesson, all of it is getting me ready for something that God has prepared for me, and so even though it hurts, like doing dumbbell presses, like doing curls, like doing burpees, even though it's not fun, like eating that lean chicken breast, like eating those vegetables, even though you don't want to always do it, like stay up late and study instead of playing Fortnite, even though you're doing that, you know at the back end of it, it's for a reason. So now I'm willing to do it. I'm willing to grind and push because just like 20 years ago, I started out trying to get stronger and guess what? I got stronger. I know if I am diligent, Right, and I'm faithful to the process and accept 
all that God gives me, all, 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 the, all the burpees that God gives me, all the push-ups that God gives me, I know it's for a reason. Right, Lance? I know I'm here for a reason. Right, Bertrand? So I know that, yes, it hurts. Right, right. Failing at a business hurts. Right, right. Failing a test hurts. But it's all part of the process, guys. And when you attach, attach that purpose to the pain you're going through, it makes going through the pain right now easier. Right? It's going to still hurt. Right? When I do bench press, I just did a 45-minute a circuit of biceps and chest, right? From, from 50-pound dumbbell presses up to 90s. And it hurt. Right? But I knew. I knew while I was doing it that what I was doing was breaking down muscle tissue. That, that the protein that I eat later will rebuild. And eventually, I'm going to be bigger and stronger and better. That's how you got to view life's, life's workouts. The workouts in life are doing the same thing for you. Right? So when Lance is doing his music, right, and this song didn't go right, he's getting ready for the big drop. Right? When Bertrand is doing his runs and he's coaching, right, and this isn't going right, he's getting ready to grow his business. Right? So all the stuff we're going through, guys, is for a reason, right? And when you begin to look at it that way, right, you can go through. Right? That's why I can work out all day. Right? I can sit there and almost throw up, but I know it's for a purpose. So the guy next to me and the girl next to me is going through the same pain I'm going through, but I know. It's for a purpose, right? I attach my pain to the purpose. My pain comes with purpose. My pain is for a purpose. I'm not just hurting for no reason. I'm hurting for a reason, right? The same way Jesus died on the cross, he wasn't just doing it. He knew that the pain was the same pain, right? The nail is the nail, but he knew it was for a purpose. So he accepted it, right? So I accept life's pain. I accept the workout's pain. I accept the, being a parent, the pain that comes with that. I accept growing a business, the pain that comes with that, because I know that it comes with a purpose, right? So if you don't want, if you don't want the, the pain, then you can't accept the purpose. You can't want the Lamborghini or, or the million dollar business or the, or, the, or the platinum record without going through the pain, right? And so I embrace it. I embrace the pain because I, I want the purpose. Right? I want to be on stage this time next year talking to thousands of people about process, about BTY, about getting better, about being the best version of you. I want that. So, so even though it's uncomfortable talking, right, people walking in, people listening to me, it's a pain I'm willing to go through because my purpose is bigger than this. Right? The, the burpee, my purpose of, of being fit and being strong is big, bigger than this workout. So the pain in this workout is irrelevant because the purpose I have and the grand scheme of things is way bigger than this workout. Way bigger. Right? So that's how life is, guys. Right? So keep dreaming. Dreaming. Don't stop dreaming. Keep wanting more. Because inside of you is greatness. Right? And, and people around you are, are trying to squash it. Right? I'm trying to put water on your fire. Right? Don't let them do it. Keep dreaming. And when you go through the pain and the frustration, right, of, of, of chasing your dream and your goal, remember that that, that pain... Is for a purpose. That pain comes with purpose. All right, guys. Enjoy your week, guys. Go get after it, right? And, and accept pain, guys. Accept the pain because you have a purpose in life, guys. I want you to live it. I want you to live it. All right, guys. Love you. Have a good day.